Good morning. It is the next day. It was my first day in Korea. I'm going to go to the gym in this hotel. Let's see what that's all about. Uh, it's nice that I have a gym here, so it'll save me some money. And I also saved money yesterday. I was very excited. I went to the medical center that was close to here. I asked the hotel desk where I can get a PCR test. So they directed me that way. And I went there. They're like, no, we only do departure tests. I'm like, oh. They're like, go that way. I'm telling you, getting directions here or anything is really, really difficult because things are explained weird, which is why the first COVID test I tried to get just didn't work. So I went to this other screening center place. It was like a community center. And I input my details and they took me through. I got the COVID test and they're like, okay, finished. I'm like, D -d -d -d. I didn't say anything, but I'm like, I guess it all had to pay for it. It was free if you get it within 24 hours of arriving. The PCR test was free. I didn't know that. I was so pleasantly surprised. It just made my day. So I'm gonna to go to Hongdae Shopping Street, which is kind of like the Harajuku um, in Japan of Seoul. Hopefully we can find some skincare stuff. I, I have some other things I need to get to, but mainly skincare and maybe some clothes cause I don't really have a lot of tops that work here. It's getting pretty hot and all I have are either long sleeves or tank tops and you, it's not really good to exposed shoulders here. So I want to get some tops that I like that would be appropriate to wear on about. Back at it with the um, bidet type of toilets. This one's pretty advanced. It's, the seat is completely heated. Heated seat. And it has all these functions. I don't know what that one is. Yeah, these don't work unless you're sitting on it. And I, I don't want to sit on it right now. But it has a dryer, it has all the those functions. Don't know what that little boy with a sideways, sideways hat is. Um, I don't know. But yes, it's very warm every time I sit down. <laughs> I kind of miss that from whenever I was in Japan, the nice toilets. All right, so I got this cool thing from this one shop and he gave me He gave me that for free, which is really cool. Um, there's a lot of cool shops here. It finally stopped raining, so. So here you can buy um, clothing sets together. This whole clothing set is is 29,000. They put a, a whole shirt, bottoms, top thing together. Kind of, kind of want to get one just because it's easier for me because I don't know that much about style. I just wear black on black on black. So I'm kind of curious as to how that would look on me. Everything here, by the way, size or size so small. Um, I think I should be able to fit into the sizing, but it's kind of like a one size type of deal for a lot of places. Vegetarian. Oh, I forget what the fruit is called. I don't know if it's called something different in Korea, but I had them a lot when I was in Japan. I like lived off of them. 
from 7-Eleven. Should I do another 7-Eleven video, actually? I could do a Korean version this time. This, this is a very Korean thing. It's kimchi, cheese, gimbap. Um, no meat. I think this doesn't have meat. I think that's what it said on there. We'll find out when we open it. But I'm very excited about that. Um, I haven't gotten anything on my list that I need to get today. It's very overwhelming here. It's much busier than I thought it was going to be. I guess it is Friday. But um, there's a lot of people, a lot of shops. So I need to go and find somewhere to get the stuff I actually need. Like the skincare stuff. It's too overwhelming to even think about that. But maybe I'll go into a store and see if I can find something because I want to get an oil cleanser and some sunscreen. I'm going to try this, I um, can't remember what it's called, but this thing you guys know. Oh, I forget how to do this. So apparently, so apparently this is not me in it. Mm. Oh. Come on, get off. Oh, so tight. Does anybody else out there loathe pants? I hate anything on my body. <laughs> But I got a lot of things. Um, I did get some beauty stuff like I intended to. Let me show you. So I got this belt thing and I'm so excited about it. This um, is a sleeping um, pack. And this one is, they're both honey. And this is what you put on at nighttime. I'm talking about beauty here and I, I've, probably have this up. Actually, let's put this right. These were on, one of these were on sale for 89, which is about like $8. And it was a buy one, get one free. So I got two for $8. And then I got this, which is the main thing that I wanted to get. And it's just a, an oil cleanser. So Koreans, they wash their face twice. They use an oil cleanser and then they use another cleanser. So this will kind of melt on my face and take off the makeup and then you deep cleanse. I got this shirt for six bucks because I needed a shirt that covered my shoulders more. Not that, like it's fine that I wear, so I see people out wearing sleeves. Something in Korea that you cannot get in America is lenses. These were seven dollars for a month long lens and these ones are gray. It comes with this cute little contact case thing. So I figured I'd try those out too. Very happy about all these things. So this is a kimchi cheese gimbap. Look at that. I mean, I love Korean food. I used to live in Koreatown and my friend and I would go to Korean all the time. Um, it's funny, I lived in Koreatown, but the only word that I learned was, um, kamsamida, just thank you. Oh, I'm so tired. I had way too much coffee today. I had two big things of coffee and that's unusual for me. It really made me crash. I wanted to keep going because I, I don't want to feel the jet lag. I want to keep waking up really early and going to bed early. I don't want to break that. I am back out trying to get groceries now because that's what I mainly need. I need groceries, I need some home essentials. I'm really tired. Like I'm exhausted. I think the jet lag is catching up to me or something. But I can't find the, the store. It's called like a Hypermark Mart Hypermart or something. Where it's like a big store that has it's like basically a Costco or something equivalent to Costco. And I'm trying to find it to get all the things that I need in one stop. Um, so once I find it, we will go grocery shopping. Get all this shopping out of the way. Shopping is exhausting. 
I'm trying out this, which it took a while to translate, but it is vegetable. So it's the vegetarian version. I think this is the vegetarian section. I'm not sure. It's all new to me. So this must be their foreign section. I noticed a lot of places have like a foreign section. So many people here, it's really hard to film, but my main priority my main priority is soup. I want to get lots of soup. Because I don't have a microwave. I need to bring a smaller camera in the store. It's too hard to film with this huge thing. It's like so noticeable. Um, it's a lot of people here too. I'm so overwhelmed. There's it's so big and crowded, I don't know where anything is and like every country, the food's all different, but like, I'm tired of translating things. I just want protein. I need some protein, but I can't find any. Okay, so that was incredibly exhausting. My God, it took me like an hour to find the store because they don't have this store like labeled on the outside. Like there's no E-Mart, like it's a huge store. And I just wandered around for so long. So I stopped and had to get this because I was really hungry and it looked really good. It has like an egg inside of it. So let me show you. Look at this. There's an egg in there. Mmm, yummy. Cinematic. Things like this just make me feel very overwhelmed. The simple thing is getting groceries. Like, I also had to get like a towel because I don't want to dirty the towels at the hotel with my hair color. I got kimchi. Very excited about that. Yeah, I didn't get much grocery. Spent way too much. I'm surprised, but maybe it's because inflation and stuff, but Seoul is actually more expensive than Tokyo for buying things. Um, I thought it would be cheaper. I, I was under the impression that Seoul is pretty cheap. Never wear t-shirts because it irritates me so much. I hate things on my neck and I hate things on my armpits. Kimchi! Kimchi. I think they put like fish stuff in everything. I don't think there's any in this, but if there is, I don't even care. Like if it's just like um, a fish flavor or something, I'm beyond it at this point. The thing I need the most is protein. I can't find it. Anyways, um, that is gonna be this video, our shopping adventure in Seoul, learning the way here. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. It's a nice way though to get, have an excuse to go out and see things that you wouldn't otherwise. Have an amazing day. Give us a thumbs up and a subscribe if you like it. I will see you in the next video. Stay to Terrestrial. Okay.